Oh, back to Ascot then, it's two year olds again but they're racing over a mile this time and the top one is Dan Buster for Jim Murray, Zulu Trooper, Joshua Sutherland, Kings Lake, Kevin Meenahan, New Values, Leon Ran Rensburg, Johnny Cash, Ryan Tamasibi, Brave Dance, Alex Cherry, Last Sunset, D. Hooley, M Emu Brook for Darren Thompson, Room Gertie for David Robertson, Sar. Kia Blaze for Derek Hinton, the sequel Eclipse for Greg Allen, Rainbow River for Martin Lee, them awesome strike Michael Scala and Lumber City Ryan Costello. All in then. And away they go in this one mile two year old race, long way for two year olds to go. And right over on the far side, New Values in the dark blue jacket, just about in the lead early on, but sequel Eclipse in the green and the yellow coming through. And then there's two in exactly the same colours the red and the black sleeves. One of them will be Jim Murray's and one of them will be somebody else's. But it's sequel Eclipse that's gone on then into the lead from Awesome Strike in second. Dan Buster is third. Then a little bit of a gap to Brave Dance and New Values. And then Zulu Trooper. Then another length or two back to Rainbow River, Lumber cities after that one and then Kings Lake and Room Gertie looking towards the back Sakia Blaze is just about the back marker at the moment but sequel Eclipse then is about a length of the good from Awesome Strike in second Dan Buster in third then Zulu Trooper is after that one New Values is next and a gap back to Rainbow River and Brave Dance racing together but it's sequel Eclipse who's taking them along and leads by a good two and a half lengths then they're well inside the final four furlongs now and sequel Eclipse is a couple of lengths clear but here comes New Values being pushed along in second and starting to get a little bit closer then comes Awesome Strike Dan Buster and Zulu Trooper Rainbow River's trying to get into it Brave Dance is being pulled out Kings Lake's trying to come with a bit of a run Sakia Blaze is getting a little bit closer looking to the back Emu Brook is a back marker but it's sequel Eclipse who's still too clear for Awesome Strike in second New Values looks one paced in third then Zulu Trooper and Dan Buster and then Rainbow River the race down towards the final furlong and a half and sequel Eclipse is in the lead and he's now still two and a half clear from Awesome Strike in second the pack are not getting near to this leader at the moment they're well inside the final furlong and sequel Eclipse is still in the lead now New Value starts to pick up and grabs on the rising ground and races up towards the line trying to catch the leader but sequel Eclipse is still in front finishing fast is Room Gertie and Room Gertie might have just stolen it on the line that's mighty close Room Gertie got very close New Values looked like it was going to swallow up the long time leader but I'll take a look on the line, it may just have held on, you know, it's close, I think Room Gertie might have got up, no, sequel Eclipse it says, so the angle's deceptive and a brave run by the winner to hold on, Room Gertie finishing like a train, new values, look, it's taking forever to get going but it's another one for Craig Allen, so sequel Eclipse takes it for Craig Allen who said yesterday he was starting to get bored and this might be his last season, so I think he might be uh, changing his mind about that after that Room Gertie second for David Robertson New Values for Leon Van Rensburg third Johnny Cash for Ryan Tamasibi was fourth and Last Sunset for D. Hooley was fifth so they're two new names to me, whether they're returners from years ago or completely new trainers, I don't know, but it's pretty good to get up in the First five in the first couple of trial races.